on sound land use planning and giving emphasis and priority to public transport and non-motorized transport. This mass transit plan, which is currently being implemented in phases, provides dynamic solutions to the challenges of congestion, limited alternatives for mass transit, and the negative environmental impacts arising from our heavy reliance on road transportation. Namata has now gazetted 12 mobility corridors, out of which seven are the core trunk mass rapid transport commuter rail corridors connecting Limuru, Gongtown, Kennel in Moranga, Kiambu, Ruai, Jomo Kenyatta International Airport, and Konza City. The, the remaining five comprise the rapid bus transport corridors along Line 2, which, will, which have now been contracted and works on them will begin soon. We are working towards ensuring that these corridors are secured in law, and this will ensure that future expansion of the transport network will be done more easily and at a much reduced cost. On its part, Kenya Railways will continue to expand its network and services through the operationalization of the remaining six DMUs and an additional 20 mini, mini train stations have been designed and will be soon be constructed along the Roiro, Kikuyu and Mbakasi lines. These additional stations will increase services to citizens along compu allowing computer passengers to increase from an average of 15,000 per day to 40,000 passengers per day. Upon further investment in additional locomotives, rolling stock and infrastructure improvement, such as additional track lines, we expect that that number to rise to an average of 130,000 passengers per day. The NMS, in conjunction with the Kenya Urban Roads Authority and Namata, is working also on enhanced traffic management through the rehabilitation and reintroduction of synchronized traffic lights across the city. NMS will construct a traffic management center at City Cabanas that will utilize traffic cameras, sensors, and an anonymized location data to provide synchronized signals at 100 new junctions in addition to the existing traffic lights, as well as redesigning and signalizing 25 additional intersections. Beyond the expansion of motorized public transport, our integrated transport plan proposes to offer safer alternatives for citizens to move around the city by non-motorized means. The NMS is implementing the non-motorized transport master plan which was developed as part of the Nairobi Urban Mobility Plan. NMS has constructed an elaborate network of footpaths interconnecting various transport termini and the CBD, and established footpaths within the CBD, improved bus and matatu termini, as well as secure bicycle parking within the CBD, matatu termini, and the Nairobi Central Station to complement its development of bicycle lanes and cycle paths across the city. So ladies and gentlemen, today marks a new dawn for transportation in our metropolitan area. The enhancements that we are launching today are not abstract. They will have very tangible real life benefits for our citizens living in Nairobi and its environs and also for the rest of Kenya. Dreams will be empowered, businesses will be revived and prosper Travel, connectivity, and enterprise will all be made easier, and unique concerns of persons living with disabilities will be better addressed. Including, in concluding my remarks, I want to thank each and every agency that delivered these momentous improvements to life in the metropolitan area, as well as the private sector players and our development partners for their support. Through the vision, hard work, and commitment of all Nairobi and the rest of Kenya will derive immense benefits. Through these and other efforts,
towards the regeneration of life in our beautiful capital city, I believe will be much improved for all her residents and Nairobi's status as the gateway and hub for East and Central Africa will be fortified. We have reason to be proud of Nairobi, the green city in the sun, for its leading the way in Africa in creating a modern, vibrant city where public transport and business enterprise solutions are delivered at superb value for money and in line and in an environmentally conscious manner that improves the living experience of all our residents of Nairobi as well as those of our visitors. Mimi sitaki kuongeza zaidi, nataka tu kuwashukuru wale wote ambao tumekuwa tukifanya kazi na wao haswa wakati huu mgumu. Nataka kushukuru wafanyikazi wa Kenya Railways, nataka kuwashukuru wafanyikazi wa eh, NMS